Clements is an early American history library, which means that we collect the original books, maps, manuscripts, and other paper materials that one would use for the serious study of early American history. We have over 80,000 books. This is one of my personal favorites, the Astronomicum Caesarium from 1540. Filled with beautiful hand-colored illustrations, these intricate paper wheels can be dialed in to make astronomical calculations. Of all the thousands of visual images in the Clements Library collection, this one stands alone. It's an engraving from 1774 of the Boston Massacre by Paul Revere. The Clements Library map catalog includes about 30,000 maps of the Americas. One of our better known maps, this plan of Fort Michilimackinac, originally drawn in 1765. Here we have a letter written in code by Benedict Arnold as he conspired to sell West Point to the British in the summer of 1780. William Clements was an Ann Arbor boy. He was born here in 1861. He went to UM, graduated, went north to Bay City ran his father's manufacturing company and prospered, became wealthy, and in his 40s decided to collect American history. And it became the, the driving obsession of his life. He was on the Board of Regents here, and in 1920 he said to his alma mater, I will give you my collection, I will build you a building. And he did so, we opened in 1923. He put approximately half his fortune into creating this library. You've got to come in, see the exhibits, see the architecture, see the printing press. If you have any interest in history, this will become one of the magical places on this campus for you.